Hello there everyone and welcome back for another mod review. Today I have three mods review for you all. First up we'll be taking a look at a really cool set of bale storage buildings. They all have an auto load feature and a few other things I'm going to show you along the way. Then we're going to take a look at two Flegel square and round bale auto load trailers version 1.0.0.3. They're two separate mods and they're only 10 megabytes each. So what I'm going to do is explain a few things regarding these mods. We'll go over the shop and check out some of the specs. Then I'll set a few things up and show you just how these work. So let's take a look. Okay, first up we're going to take a look at these awesome little bale storage units here. Now you will need the global script. I'm going to leave a link for you down below. It's called the Global Company Mod. Just download that as if you would a zip file and put it in your mods folder. You'll need that for this mod to work. And I'll show you how that script works once we get going here. So this is the LWG Europe Placeable Bale Storage version 1.0.1. File size for this is 16 megabytes. Price in the shop for each unit is 25,000 with a $150 a day maintenance fee. So there's eight different buildings you can choose from to store your grass, hay, straw, and silage bales. So you can see right here on this unit, right up above, there's two grass bales there. Now, yeah, let's check out the beacon on it and everything. So yeah, when you come up close to it, you're going to see your bale storage in and out. Then you're going to have a little monitor over here. You come up and let's get that up on the screen now if you press left control and G that's to activate your global company menu that's what you had to download there that I told you about and then you're gonna be on this screen so this will tell you everything you need to know about each unit and you can rename them as well so yeah you can see I renamed that one power food you can take this one here and what is this grass just grass storage okay so yeah, you can write that down here if you wanted to. Just backspace, get rid of that. Grass. Storage. Confirm. And look at that. Perfect. So you can go to each individual one and press the open overview screen to get details about each one. Just click on that. And it'll show you your fill levels, your percentage, your capacity, which is 972,000 liters. I tried to do a little math here, and that's 243 bales. Because bales are 4,000 liters each, and that's about 8.1 loads of bales. We're using these trailers here. These are really cool trailers too, guys. Wait till you check these out. They get a really cool unloading feature. So yeah, you can uh, see everything here, keep track of your fill levels and everything. So that's what the global script does. And you can scroll down here to all eight of your bins. Okay, so I have them all set up here. I have all square on one side and all round at the other. All square along here. And like I said, there's a picture up top to show you what it is. Plus it'll say down in the bottom right hand corner. Let's go around the corner here. Here are your round ones. Obviously that's grass, hay, straw, and silage. Okay. So yeah, they can hold 243 bales. So that's quite a lot. Almost a million liters worth. So yeah, I've been, I did quite a bit of work and got a bunch of stuff ready here. Let's go over to the shop before we get too far ahead of ourselves. There it is over in the shop. Just click on that and all eight of them are listed right here. So don't forget, you'll need the global company script. And I'll, I'll include the link down the bottom. They're all $25,150 a day. So yeah, it took me a while to get all this stuff set up. I got all f eight things we'll need. Okay, next up we're going to be taking a look at these Flegel square and round auto load flatbeds version 1.0.0.3. Both of them are 10 megabytes. Now I'm reviewing both of them together. These are two separate mods, one for the square and one for the round. File size for this is 10 megabytes. Price in the shop is 25,500 with a $0 a day maintenance fee. Now it'll hold 30 square bales or 34 round bales and they have multicolor rims as well. Under baling technology all the way over to the end, there's the one for the round bales and one for the square. They're identical. You can change the rim color. Like I said, 34 round or 30 square. So we can take a little look around at that. Just a basic loading trailer, but this got a cool little feature when you're unloading. You can use your mouse and actually lift them up and place them just where you want. Really nice little feature there. Okay, let's jump in our cat. 
you can see I got a bunch of stuff set up over there it took me a while to get that all going eight different things for eight different storage buildings let's grab our first one here I do believe this one is uh, for square okay let's bring up our HUD here so we're gonna press B to put it in operating position and we're gonna grab our hay bales okay press B for transporting And let's go put these in storage now I have that teleport mod I hope that doesn't mess anything up okay what do we have here I love that the little signs are above them so you can tell I think it's this one right here okay just long enough unload bales you can see you put them right there now if I hold in my mouse button I can pull that up drag it around put it right through the other side I can go right through my trailer look at that how awesome is that drag it up down side to side put it down press the Y key and look at that boom that is awesome okay next up we have some straw bales so let's press the Y key lower landing platform go into the operating position and we'll grab some straw okay press B for transport and the second one is for straw okay unload and sometimes it'll do that but you can just straighten it out again but it's kind of perfect for if you're doing a bunch in a row but look I can grab that and put it right back and you can also bail out of uh, if you don't want to put it down you can abort it let's put that down see abort auto loading X but we're gonna unload the bales press it again look at that boom I love, I love the little beak in there that's awesome so how many bales was that that's 60 bales okay let's get some grass bales lower operate grab them up transport grass bales I love these things they're awesome okay unload bales Y to confirm look at that so that beacon just goes for a second I take it and then it stops grab them all up why to unload why beautiful okay so to get your bales back what you want to do is come over to this sign or anywhere in the trigger and press the arrow key that'll bring up this menu here click on your silage bales over here and then you can press Q and E to uh, take out as many as you want it's gonna say pallets but we know we got 30 bales in there so just press maximum it'll tell you 30 is ready to go there and you can use your uh, mouse as well and click on these or you can use your keys so we spawn 30 let's press that there and they're 
ready for pickup right on the side of the building look at that so that is perfect let's go ahead and pick them up let's bring up our HUD here lower platform there we go alright so that works perfect okay let's try some round bales okay let's hook on up to our trailers here these got some really cool beacons on it too these trailers check it out in the back that's awesome okay so it's ready for pickup we'll start with some hay bales okay let's fix that okay transport there's no straps on these unfortunately but they won't go anywhere Okay, hay bales first. That'll be the very first one, I guess. Or no, this one actually. Okay, unload. There we go. Lower platform. Get some grass bales next. I eh, might as well keep them over on this side. I'm sure there's a way around that, but it's not that bad. They'll just pass through anything, so it's not a big, big deal. We're going to have to bring it over to the other side of the trailer, though. I think it's pretty neat that you can do that. Here's our grass bales there. There we go. Okay, silage bales. Okay, just some straw to go. Oops, we missed one. So like I said, 34 round bales or 30 square bales. very nice I love that okay let's pull this guy to the side and we'll check out what we have in storage we can do it by hand like I said just come inside the trigger press R press on this side bills outsourcing click on maximum 34 if you want to take all 34 out or you can just go one at a time but it'll say pallets instead of bales Spawn all 34. Back. So there you have it, folks. That was the LWG Europe Placeable Bale Storage version 1.0.1. That was 16 megabytes. Then we have the Flegel Flatbed Square and Round Bale Auto Load Trailers version 1.0.0.3. Those are 10 megabytes apiece. Additional information and links can be found down below in the description. Guys, thank you so much for watching today's review. If you liked it, maybe you can leave a like down below. And if you're new to the channel, why don't you go ahead and click on Nick right there in the middle of your screen. Then hit the subscribe button and the bell. And I'll bring you new mod reviews every second day and Let's Plays every other day. 
plus my Patreon link is just below that if you'd like to help and contribute to the channel. It really helps out. So, until next time, take care, and I will see you all in the next one.